welcome to May from uh, Barcelona. Back in the UK, gonna go home. Back in Chennai, back where I live, um, my company broadside is screening some films tonight. We will be showing some films. Who is this little Austrian farmer living in the living in Pembrey, actually? And he was like, yeah. Painfully hot in Cardiff today. It's about what 25 degrees Celsius, 20, literally less than two months ago at this very spot. It was snowing and it was minus two degrees Celsius. What is up? Went to go see a quiet place finally last night in the cinema. Very good. I absolutely would recommend going to see it. Not as scary, in my opinion, as people said it was. It wasn't really horror scary, it was more like a thriller. Um, it's got the stamp of approval of me, which means absolutely nothing. I feel like I'm just about to pass out, which is amazing. I'm gonna go to a film screening tonight and hopefully not pass out. Oopsie oopsie. Get the nut, man. I'm in Swansea today for a screening of that um, 48 hour film challenge I did a few weeks ago. I don't want any more of your eggs! I'm gonna shoot today in Mumbles. Dean's acting. No, that's when? No. Just down that sort of. All these coffees are the same? Huh? Yeah, they're all black and the milk is on the side. That's me. I've come to Beaconsfield, which is just outside London, because I want to shoot the National Film Television School for the next few days. I'm not entirely sure what the content of that shoot will be, but I'm sure it'll be fun. Right. Yeah, yeah I just did just the commercial on the huh? Can we squeeze through there? No. Well, today went well. I had a lot of fun. Oh my god, there's a puddle there. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna, gonna have some food. I'm gonna see what happens tomorrow. Shot in a cinema. I'm shot in a house. That's what I do. No. Apparently, there is a room, apparently. We... Oh. Oh. Not too far. And that's that. Back to Wales. So I got back at like 3.30, had a few hours sleep, and now I am shooting in Swansea today, again. Well, you have a good mood today. Uh, yes, ma'am, I am. Well, that was fun. Got back a couple of hours ago into Snatchley. Uh, we're in a... Uh, going to a film screening tonight of a documentary that someone I know worked on. Martha! <laughs> Martha! She knows you, Kerry. Yes, she does. She knows you guys. Yeah. 
So we watched a film last night and it was really good. Film Worker is about Stanley Kubrick's assistant and it, I would recommend seeing it. It's premiering at Cannes in a couple of days. So I don't think we should have seen it, but we still saw it and it was great. Um, got a meeting today with Matty for something next week. I don't know. If you live in the last week, go there. We're going to go see if we can check out what that is. It looks like the us, but let's go find it out. the church burns to the ground and everybody disappears. Not everybody, but most of us disappear. And uh, Dan uh, runs the Strady Park Hotel. Yeah. So I just shot and took part in an interview for a feature film that I'm starring in, have starred in, that is currently out on iTunes. It's called Shadow of the Missing. It's a horror. It happened. Um, and I just did an interview for it, inter and, and, and I just did an interview for it. Today has been very eventful. That it looks alright, Dean. Yeah, let's see. But you uh, see, the thing is, Dean, you're never gonna rock sunglasses as well as this baby does. Yeah, I think you're kind of. Let's see. Let's turn her on. Oh, <laughs> baby. <laughs> Dean. <laughs> You left the table, huh? Just guys being dudes. It's um, it's a rabbit warren, and you can find us on Twitter at Swansea Sound or on our Facebook page too. Now we're going to say someone, uh, say hi to someone whose voice you you hopefully will recognise. So we just shot a radio interview for the film that has been released, and you should go and watch it. And we're going to go see some more films. We're some burgers. There's meat there. We're gonna go on a Phil hunt, we're gonna hunt Phil. So I shaved, um, because it's the awards uh, for the evening for the festival, for the awards evening for the festival that I've been attending for the past week. Yes, we've come a long way over the last seven years from when I first had the, the idea to start a festival. And we go live now to the Royal Wedding, which is just watching. A Land Rover creep across the screen for two minutes and then we cut to shots, wide shots, and nothing going on. This has been going on for like half an hour. What is going on? Why are people interested in this? I don't understand. Oh! Back to the Oscars. Almost done. Oh my god, this, this is tense. And that dude's won. <laughs> BBC Radio 1 is running an academy in Swansea this week, so I'm going to go to a couple of the workshops they're doing, I guess, because Dean is actually talking at one. I'm a freelance filmmaker, so what I'm saying is, allow yourself a failure every now and again. How's he talk, Dean? Huh? How's he talk, Dean? I didn't talk. at the BBC Ready One event again. Really fun, saw Sigrid live, did a workshop with her. Uh, it's all in preparation for the biggest weekend, which is this weekend in Swansea and like, you know, Panic! The Disco and Ed Sheeran and Taylor Swift and Niall Horan and a bunch of other artists are performing, but I can't make it, which is really sad, but oh well. I've come to Ascot, just outside of Reading, um, to do a shoot tonight. That's gonna be fun. Thought you left without me. We did. It's called Thursday. Ascot, because it's got that ass. I am the voice of my industry 2000. 
I think that is the Batmobile. That's the old. I still don't quite know what we're shooting. Well, let's have a look then. Got me to ask him to pick up the tree. <laughs> move it, move the tree. tree. <laughs> yeah. what, mate? In Australia, the NBC came Kids there, right? Out of the way, dopey. Well, that was fun. <sighs> now to pack up. It's ridiculously busy in Cardiff today, and also really humid. I think there's gonna be a thunderstorm tonight. Oh, just uh, getting some stuff at the Welsh shop. That's not Welsh. Hey, if you know what I mean. Gonna go see Solo, a Star Wars story. The brand new episode of the Star Wars story. Solo was good. It was enjoyable. I'm glad that I spent the money to go see it. I'm happy that I saw it. It was just a film. Nothing special about it. I'd see it if you don't want to spend too much money on it. I wouldn't say it's the best film I've seen all year, but it's enjoyable. I would say it was, it was just, it was good. Sometimes I think it felt a little bit confused, like it wasn't quite sure where it wanted to be going or what it was trying to do, but it was overall very enjoyable. It was just a fun film. What are we doing today? I don't know. I've had it painted in, but I haven't yeah. watched it in two years, so that's why it looks really authentic. Who's the Sheila? Oh, fuck the spiders. Quick shoot today. Quick promotional video shoot today for an open mic I'm uh, playing at tomorrow with Matty. First birthday bash this Friday night. Hey everyone, it's been a year since we started Ruby's Unplugged. So we're having our first birthday bash this Friday night. We've got some special guests coming and some old familiar faces as well. Well, that was fun. Me, it's Jim Dean, hey, surf up. Surf up. What are we doing today, Dean? Uh, painting. We're painting our studio. Exciting. Your studio. My studio, my studio, we're painting the studio. Exciting filmmaking. I'm gonna get hit. Dean, yeah. working hard? No. We have stopped the painting due to the presence of a bee's nest, which we don't really want to disturb. 